Alrighty, going to teach you guys how to use MSI Afterburner on screen display. So first things first, you're going to need to download MSI Afterburner. You need to search it on Google. Give it a second for it to load. And then you're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom. And then it should show up here. So download. Open. And then open it, extract all, select your language, then next, accept, and then you want to make sure to get this as well. <clears throat> And then, yes, it might say that I already have this. It might ask for me to replace it. Okay, so you can just close that. You don't have to read it. Now yours might open up differently. I have mine set up to look like this. Yours might not. It doesn't matter. Uh, you're just gonna go over to settings, which it's either a gear or settings like this. And then you're gonna go over to monitoring. So here you can see that it, some of these are checked off, some of them aren't. I'm gonna uncheck all of these that I use, and then I'm gonna recheck them myself just to make sure they're in proper order. So whatever you click first, it's going to be top, and then bottom, and then so on and so forth. Whatever, good enough. Alright, so I want my GPU usage to be my first thing. So you click it, and then you want to make sure to highlight on the screen display. So it will have in OSD. So you just want to make sure that's showing. If it's not, you just click it. I want my CPU usage back. Don't care about that. Seven. Eight. I only have six cores. So where is six? It skips it. <laughs> five. There it is. Five and six. Average frame, minimum, average, max, and then the two lows. So you can see here that it's not there, so just on screen, on screen, apply, and OK. So now you want to make sure MSI is still up like this over in the corner. And then you just want to click this and make sure to see this logo as well. Then go into a game. I'm going to do Fortnite. So you just want to make sure the tuners there and MSI Afterburner are both open in the background. I might need to download an update for this. I definitely do. Oh, I'm not signed in. Huh. Okay, let's do another game. I cannot remember my password. Uh, what's a quick game to load up? 
That one takes forever. Just try the forest. Super, super easy. Oh, it's going to ask for a password again. Gosh darn it. I remember that one. Okay, and now you guys can see that it's over here in the corner. Some of it may take a little bit to load out. So there is two things missing here. My FPS. So I'm going to quickly go back to MSI Afterburner. See if I can figure that out. I'm going to try just turning it off. Frame rate. Okay. There's the frame rate. Now let's go back, try to get the other ones going. Sometimes it doesn't open for whatever reason. You just have to keep trying. Um, <sighs> let's just see. Yeah, it's weird. Sometimes you have to close it, reopen it. But real quick, just to show you guys, it can sometimes fail, so I will try closing and closing and then go back to the game and we'll be gone. Go back over to MSI Afterburner and try to reopen it. <clears throat> then minimize. Wait for that to come up. So it should be working now. Sometimes it takes a few minutes to come up, and then other times it won't come up at all. And there it is. But it still didn't pull up the average FPS. There you guys go. Plain and simple.